right, KJ70, going to do a test here, recording myself on the ASF Web SDR. Just doing a quick test. Uh, this is a Yaesu FTDX 101 MP, and uh, the microphone is a Shure SM7B. And it feeds into a Behringer Ultra Game Pro Mic 2200, which is a tube mic preamp. Uh, from there, it feeds into a Behringer Ultra Curve Pro DQ2496, where one channel I do some downward expanding for noise gating. So I use Vox most of the time, so whenever uh, in between breaths or let the radio tr uh, go back to receive, uh, it's a nice, clean, silent transition. The output of that channel feeds into the other channel, where I do three bands of parametric EQ and then a little bit of audio compression. From there uh, into a, a W2IHY iBox, which takes the line level uh, balanced audio, converts it to uh, mic level unbalanced into the front input or mic input on the radio. The radio I set up on the spectrum analyzer with uh, white noise for a flat response. So basically the radio is flat and I do a little bit of EQing to get a proper uh, sound from the microphone in the uh, EQ 2496. Uh, running 200 watts right now into an inverted V from Lake Hughes, California, and recording on the KSF Web SDR. Making a recording, an MP3 so I can download most of myself since the band is really good right now and fairly quiet. And uh, let's see, here's some other settings for my own note. Um, running the AMC control at 80, and mic gain right now is set at 25. Um, I set the AMC control to fast under uh, the advice of somebody just to try it and see how it sounds, and I do seem to like it. And uh, mid-range mid ALC, not seeing much activity on compression. Every once in a while, I'll see it pop up to maybe 2 to 5 dB. KJ70. KJ70. Uh, testing a little bit more. I'm going to add a little bit more detail here. The uh, web SDR I have set to a 4.05 kilohertz bandwidth. On the radio, I'm transmitting the 50 to 3050 bandwidth. And let's see here. Right, let's go with that, KJ70.